ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the Body Bag Match. The rules are quite simple. The individual who wins this contest will be that man who puts his opponent incapacitated inside the body bag. And now, introducing the participants. To be led down the aisle by Paul Bearer from Fifth Valley, weighing 328 pounds, The Undertaker. The Undertaker has had his sights set on the Ultimate Warrior, dating all the way back to the spring when the dead man locked Warrior inside an airtight casket. At the risk of questioning Warrior's thought process, he had to know something was up the moment he stepped foot onto the set of Paul Bear's funeral parlor. are simple folks when one man is deemed incapacitated and put inside the body bag only then can the other man be declared the winner yeah and it's worth pointing out that there are no disqualifications and no count outs the only way this one's going to end is with one of these two men enclosed in a body bag can you imagine what these two men will have to do to incapacitate the other enough to get him into a body bag Warriors plan has got him on a roll here tonight. And there's that modified judo throw, the STO. Can he capitalize? This match taking place inside the same New York City arena where the Ultimate Warrior claimed the Intercontinental Championship at SummerSlam 1988. Yes, but Undertaker is already having considerably better success than the Honky Taunt Man did that night against the Warrior. and ferocity of the Ultimate Warrior is... What is Ultimate Warrior planning to do here? Oh, what? my God! The Warrior, Warrior with a palm back to the Undertaker! I don't know if I can remember seeing the Ultimate Warrior do that, but look at that! No effect whatsoever on the dead man! The Undertaker sat right up! And Warrior again going after the Undertaker! Another power driver! Oh, Are you kidding me? Two of them! And Undertaker oh. sat back up again! Maybe the third time's the charm, Warrior. And I think that's what the Warrior's thinking. A third power driver here. Oh! That has to be it. Oh! Phenom is down. An ultimate Warrior now. The Warrior may have finally discovered what it takes to keep... Oh! Oh, no! Went for the splash! Undertaker caught him coming in! Warrior and Undertaker facing off! Oh, my gosh, what's next, Michael? A hush has fallen over this New York City crowd in a hurry. Undertaker taking the crowd out of it in the early going. That's exactly what he needs to do here. Oh, you're right, Cole. Warrior draws a lot of his power and money. Oh, it's Undertaker. Oh, big shot! And now, Tombstone, Cole, he's going for the Tombstone. I can't believe it, it's over. Paul Barry, oh. he hits it. The Tombstone pile driver. Oh, the Undertaker definitely has things well in hand. And look, look at this. 
Paul Bearer is gesturing to The Undertaker. It's time to finish this match. Put the warrior in the body bag. <laughs> Can you imagine? You're the ultimate warrior, and you're about to be placed into that, that, that bag. Well, the only thing the ultimate warrior knows right now is darkness because I think he's unconscious. Look at Paul Bearer, this creep. The bag is laid out in the ring. Oh, another shot by The Undertaker. Well, it looks like this is over. All The Undertaker has to do as Paul Bearer urges him on is zip that body bag shut, and the Warrior is finished. But look at the Warrior. Wait, Cole, there's life left in the Warrior. Warrior's fighting out of the body bag. Oh. He's fighting out of the body bag. Warrior's not done yet. Another shot, and the Warrior's up. He's out of the bag. He's to his feet. Oh, Warrior's on the comeback trail. Well, he was able to reverse it. Get out of that. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Earlier tonight, King, Randy Savage dropped a bombshell while appearing as Brutus Beefcake's guest on the barbershop. That's right. Not only did Savage proclaim his love for Miss Elizabeth, but he also said he wants to marry her at SummerSlam. I can't believe it, Cole. A wedding at the biggest event of the summer? Oh, did you see the force behind that? Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. He's got him up. And just tossing him to the ground. Never ever underestimate the sheer force behind this superstar's punches. Got out of the way of that one. Oh. Ultimate Warrior gets out of trouble quickly. Nobody has been able to stop Undertaker to this point, but Warrior appears to be doing everything in his power to be the first. Man, Warrior does appear to be in a good spot here, Cole, but I wonder, is that body bag even big enough to fit The Undertaker? That remains to be seen. If it is big enough, it will definitely be a tight squeeze. Undertaker comes in at nearly seven feet tall and 328 pounds. Let's not forget that the Ultimate Warrior literally forced one of the all-time greats, Randy Savage, into retirement at WrestleMania 7. So while hard to believe, a win over The Undertaker here may not be all that far-fetched. I still can't believe we've seen the end of the Macho Man. You'd have to think he had plenty more good years left in him. That's what happens when you test The Ultimate Warrior. But speaking of WrestleMania 7, that night, we also saw Undertaker decimate a great in his own right. Jimmy Superfly Snuka. Yeah, what an amazing WrestleMania debut it was for The Undertaker. Judging from the way he tore through Snuka, I'm willing to bet the dead man will have quite an impressive WrestleMania resume when it's all said and done. King, it's worth mentioning that we're witnessing the Ultimate Warrior's first ever body bag match here. Yeah, and it looks like Warrior's lack of experience in this type of atmosphere is starting to cost him. But can Undertaker finish him off? We've seen the Ultimate Warrior down before, but very rarely has anybody been able to finish the job. Oh my gosh, it looks as if Undertaker will be placed in his own body bag if this continues. I've never seen Undertaker manhandled like this before, King. We may be witnessing the end of the dead man. And Ultimate Warrior doing everything in his power. Oh, look at this. Michael Lee's clotheslines are taking their toll on The Undertaker. Another one. Another? Yes, another clothesline. But The, the Undertaker keeps getting to his feet, and now... Look at that, he hit the Undertaker with the urn. Ultimate Warrior in complete control. I think, and I now, think and the Undertaker's now, out. Yeah, I think he's out too. And now Ultimate Warrior. Uh-oh, Paul Bearer, Paul Bearer has the urn. Bearer has the urn. Yeah, but the Ultimate Warrior has the body bag. And there goes the Undertaker. The Undertaker's in that body bag. The Undertaker's in the body bag, King! Ah! Warrior's done it! The unthinkable! The winner of the body bag match, the ultimate warrior! Paul oh, Bearer on the outside, bleeding, talking to that urn. What's inside that urn? Who knows? Oh, yeah, well, look at this! Undertaker's already out of the body bag! 
Are you kidding me? How does The Undertaker draw power from that urn? This is amazing and scary.